Hi, this is Rebecca Delosier, and this is a tutorial on how to install a network printer on your new MacBook. The first thing you're going to want to do is go up to your Apple menu in the top left corner of your screen and then go to System Preferences. Once you get your System Preferences open, you're going to go to the second row Hardware and all the way over to where it says Print and Scan. Once you've opened Print and Scan, you should see that this this lock in the lower left hand corner is unlocked. If it's not, you'll need to click on that and you'll need to type in your network password to do that. Um, and that will allow you to go ahead and add a printer. Your screen might actually just have um, a printer search function up for you, but you can see I've already added a printer. So I have to go here to this plus sign, add a printer. If you haven't added a printer, your screen will look very similar to this. So in the search section, you're going to go ahead and you're going to type um, LHS-print-LHS underscore. And that's going to get you to a list of the printers, the network printers that are here in the building. Um, and it's a pretty extensive list, so you really do need to know what printer you're, you're using, but you should already have that. It's whatever printer you've been using from your drop-down menu on your old um, HP or Dell, depending which laptop you have. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to set up a, um, a workroom copier. So this would allow me to print to the actual teacher workroom. And it says workroom copier HV underscore two. So I'm going to go ahead and add that. And then it says use or choose a driver or printer model. So here, the easiest thing to do is just to select the generic postscript printer and then click add. And that's it. And you can go in and you can set whether or not you want it as your default printer or not. I actually am setting the science department printer to be my default printer.